Center in Kabartonjo. It is uh, it has, it has been uh, quite a, uh, an issue which needs to be addressed urgently because mm -hmm. Kabartonjo town is growing and as it grows the population grows there is need for water and sanitation proper sanitation in Kabartonjo and if, uh, that's a, a, a town which now needs to be modernized and one thing that is very essential is water one is uh, as an incoming MP, I'll ensure that Gildam phase two water project. You imagine Gildam Mingi na in a south cabernet na wata ki wekwa yo phase two, you imagine if you can there'll be enough water. The also uh, last time SK uh -huh. our my former party leader uh -huh. promised that the sub counties which manage to the constituencies which give Mendeleev Chap Chap uh, an MP, an MP uh -huh. they would give, be given a water the drilling machine. Uh -huh. That is one thing which even motivated me to work to choose with, the to choose the, the, that party at that time. Uh -huh. And uh, one thing which I want to promise the people of Baringo North. We will allocate some of the CDF uh, funds to get a water water uh, drilling machine, uh -huh. so that we, you know, we, we can also get the machine from donors. So lazima to to me there are organizations which assist people to get water. Uh -huh. So with that one of Kabatunga, I believe to keep at your face too, it was sort out the issue of water problems, in the water shortage in Kabatunga. Uh, a lovely water drilling machine and then we we, we even uh, assist people to harvest rain water no. well you mentioned mm. something about the promise by my little chap chap and i think we have an mp in baringo central mm -hmm. i'm not aware yeah but uh, I'm not aware. <laughs> I'll find out from you. Yeah. I'll, I'll find out. Uh, that, that, that. But these are things which uh, <laughs> you know, sometimes they say it's uh, said than done. But I mm -hmm. want to say that I want to be a, an, an MP who means his words. Mm -hmm. yes. who, who says, you know, promises that. So, so, so look on uh, William Ruto, the DP, the, the fifth president, God willing. You will understand what I'm saying. I'm going to tell you. But I'm going to tell you. Naya mambo nitafuatilia na kikisha nitatenda. Chinzi ni naifanya mambo ile ni maahidi watu kule Baringo North. Yeah. Yes. Well, to the bit of mobilization, we are yes. heading towards the end of our conversation. Mm -hmm. We see Baringo North as a constituents with quite a rich number of senior government officials. Mm -hmm. Among them is uh, uh, the former PS Segor who resigned the mm -hmm. other day and quite a number of them who are in public service. Mm -hmm. Um, we see a united Baringo North. Mm -hmm. I don't know in your in your in your opinion right now. How is mm -hmm. it, and how are you planning to bring these people together to mm -hmm. even support your candidature? Mm -hmm. Because these are very uh, these are people. Ani watu akona useme kwenye upande machinani. How well have you mobilized these people? One, uh, uh, I've been able to work mm -hmm. with uh, these people mm -hmm. to assist. The communities we meet with them mm -hmm. in various uh, activities yeah. they are to assist in building of schools assisting uh, because in assisting people mm -hmm. in in baringo north and i want to say it's a blessing for us to have people with such capacity mm -hmm. learned people people who have been in government mm -hmm. and uh, I, I want to say that uh, this most of these people we have worked very closely and uh, I have talked to them. Mm -hmm. One, they have to give me their vote. Because if they have, have uh, a vote, Kule mm -hmm. Baringo North. And uh, I, I am glad to note that uh, I have uh, the support of most of these uh, senior people, senior professionals also mm -hmm. from Baringo North. And uh, I, I promise them that I will not let them down. And mm -hmm. the fact that you are saying that you've been working with them before, I believe mm -hmm. they, they will definitely give you their support. Anyway. Yes, yes. Yeah. I was asking that because I could see someone is asking how you're planning to bring them together because they may be having a divergent opinion. 
Yes, like yes, and actually, what one thing, mm -hmm. one of the things that we need to do in Baringo North, we have a, a lot of people with capacity, people who can even invest within the the, the sub county, mm -hmm. and we have to bring these people together. I will engage professionals. I will talk to them. There are people who can even sponsor children. One of the things that we we have to address in Baringo North when I ask you, mm -hmm. Masomo education it's not only about access but we want our children to have quality education and that we <laughs> don't you know i have an education background mm -hmm. I'm, I'm a professional teacher mm -hmm. and i'm an education philosopher and uh, one we, we have to really assist our children to get the best education both primary and secondary now kabaringo north Nangependa kwa hidi, kwa hidi, watu wa Baringo North. Na hasa, wale ambao wanajua kwamba our children can do better than the way they are doing right now. Kwamba, wanachelanga hii ya harapenge. Atasaidia watoto kufanya wizuri katika. Mtiani yao ya darasa la nani? One, one thing, simple thing, which I have also seen work somewhere. Lunch program. Kwa watoto wetu wa darasa la saba na la nani. Sponsored, fully sponsored by CDF. That will become a reality. School in, uh, uh, yes, from uh, from September. Uh -huh. From September this year. Was a babu in Naimani in Takwa MP. We wish you. Yeah, to talk to you. What to talk to you at school when I read this in Naimani lunch. Our candidates, we talk to you in class 7. Now in class 8. Wakati, in lunchtime, when I leave you at school, when I leave you I will also work very closely with the teachers and motivate them. We have very good teachers in Baringo North. And I work very closely with them. They'll find an MP who will motivate them. Mm -hmm. Our teachers need to be motivated. And then the use of CDF. I will bring back the issue of price giving. Maybe we look at number of Katiyo. Lakini we have to recognize teachers and people who do well. And uh, for from my side, I've been doing before even on my personal capacity, mm -hmm. assisting people. Wale wana pita mtiani vizuri uh -huh. Walipia karo Na hata kuwapatia motivation Hata kuwapatia shopping uh -huh. I, I work with other teachers with, with other teachers leaders And in some counties Kuna watoto wale waki Pita mtiani wana well, Let's say 350 Wanafanyua shopping yote Na ungine wanasaidua hata kulipa school fees But I, I, I want to say that When it comes to the use of CDF Especially Bazari uh -huh. Tutakisha kwamba we give to those who deserve. Okay. Well, that, I think that that bit of uh, mm -hmm. equitable distribution of resources.